Okay, so my phone is skipping back a lot today. Like it's skipping back so much that even though I'm holding my thumb on it, it's not letting me stay on. I took this bucket away from Karina because she keeps sitting in it. But I'm gonna put her blocks away tonight. But um, even my thumb on it though, it's not staying on the video. So that bites. Yeah, I still am working on the budget, surprisingly enough. Um, I'm trying to figure out the November and December costs of everything in my life. And then um, when I can implement um, my new budget after December when this house cuts off and the other house really starts up. So, I mean, we already have the propane taken care of. We already have the homeowner's insurance taken care of. We already have... Um, the car insurance is taken care of for the six months. We already have like all that stuff taken care of. It's just, I don't know, figuring out what we're doing for the roof. Because I thought we could get it in December, but the numbers aren't crunching the way that I want them to. So, I don't know, it seems like we only have like enough for like a third of it. It or something, and we might have to put the rest of it either on a credit card or it's just I don't know, wait for the tax return or something, or I'll sell the Jeep sooner. Oh, my baby's up. So, honestly, I'm thinking that Jeep just getting rid of that will fix everything. What's wrong, baby? Oh, she's teasing. You okay? Your teeth hurt? This is why it's so hard to clean at night when you have a baby anyway. You make too much noise into waking them up. She's probably like, my blocks, I could hear them. That's why they come all the time. Poor baby. But yeah, um, so I have some new numbers for the budget now, thanks to a friend. And um, I'm going to try and crunch the new numbers and try and make the budget work better. So... Honestly, going into the new budget, I was like, oh my gosh, we have all this extra money, like, everywhere. But now, um, I don't really feel like we have all this money, all this extra money everywhere now. I feel like we really have to keep buckled down with the budget, and, um, you know, I think next year, April and September are the three, the three paycheck months, because every year you get two months that have three Fridays in them, like, you know, an extra week. So, I mean, that money has to go into savings. No frivolous little family vacation, nothing like that. Um, because I really thought... What is he doing? There's probably something in it that he could hear. Oh, throw that string away. I was going to throw that away. It's from the jewelry set. <laughs> Well, right now I'm nursing Karina, doing a video. Okay. Yeah, but I really did feel like, you know, we were out of, like, this really tight budget. Like, we're no longer negative. I really thought that we were doing so much better. But really, 
we're getting a closer look at the budget, I guess we're not doing so much better like I thought. We're just a little bit better. So, you know, I'm going to have to write down the numbers, I guess, and really take a closer look again because right now what I think is working probably isn't really going to work, so I don't know. I wanted to do a vacation fund too. I wanted to set aside $50 a month towards a vacation for the family. So this way we could start an annual like tr like traditional vacation fund, but I think we have to wait until we get the land. It's only three to five years away, and land is really cheap, you know, in the type of areas and type of land I'm looking for, it's really cheap. If I had an extra ten or $20,000, I'd get it now, but I don't. I guess this is what I'm going to be doing for a while, just feeding my baby. And um, I bagged up all the clothes. I did get that done. I did the dishes. Got that done. So I got some things done around the house. I gave James some tea and some stuff. I still need to brush and clean his teeth before we actually go to bed. Um, I don't like staying up late to clean, though. I really don't. Like I was telling James, this is why I just go to bed, because the house doesn't really matter to me right now. You know, I'm barely in it. I'm barely home. My cat's running around. I don't know. Life changes so quickly and so much. Like, I go through my videos sometimes and I watch them and I'm like, wow, my life is really different. Even just, like, a number of months ago, like, the house was rearranged different, like, and then we just moved into this place a year and change ago. We're moving out, you know? Life changes a little bit every day. I don't know, I guess I do have, like, a primal fear of dying, too. You know, everybody does. I don't know, I just need to make it so my daughter's 18, but I don't really care. But, um, yeah. This is basically what we're doing. The luckiest mama in the world, I think. Uh, seems like a lot of people don't agree with some life choices, but I mean, no one agrees with everyone all the time. I say I wouldn't change my life for the world. Alright, well I guess that's it for my update. This is what I'm doing, this is what I'm thinking about. I need to find a way to get a pen and paper. And uh, relook at the budget. So, so I've been working on the last number of days is the budget. Kind of hoping I'd be able to get a different phone too because this phone is broken, the other one's broken. But honestly, I don't think it's going to happen. And honestly, I think there'd be a one car family for like the next six months or so. We might actually use it two extra paychecks to buy a different car. Yeah, we might actually, because it's three thousand something dollars. So we could have a second car if we get the roof first. Because, like, I want a roof, I want a shed, I want a dishwasher, you know, oil. I want a 